Hello. In this particular question, we have to find out a unique solution for x. See, it's very important that the solution has to be unique and also it has to be positive. Now, the first equation given to me is x square minus y square is 0, which essentially means that x square is equal to y square. Then if we put the same in the second equation, what are we going to get? We are going to get x minus k whole square and y square is equal to x square. So this is x square, which is 1. So what does this give me? This gives me x square minus 2kx plus k square plus x square, which is equal to 1. Or this reduces to the quadratic 2x square minus 2kx plus k square minus 1. This is equal to 0. Now, in this particular quadratic equation, for the solution to be unique, what should happen? b square should be equal to 4ac because only then b square minus 4ac will be 0. The discriminant will be 0 and only then you will get a unique uh, solution. So let's make that. What is b? b is minus 2k. So b square will be 4k square and 4ac. 4ac will be 4 into 2 or 8 times k square minus 1. So what does this give me? This gives me 4k square and 8k square minus 8. So 8k square minus 4k square will be 4k square minus 8 is 0 or k square is equal to 2 or k is equal to plus minus root 2. But both root 2 as well as minus root 2 are there in the options. That is why we need to look at the second part of the question which says that the solution has to be positive. If the two uh, roots are equal, then they are equal to minus b by 2a. So what will they be in this situation? They will be minus b or 2k upon 2a or by 4 or the two roots will be k by 2. Now, if we want the two roots which are equal, the unique solution to be positive, then k also should be positive and that means the value of k will be the positive root of 2 or option C. Thank you.